it gives me great pleasure to say that there's only one case that I can think of in recent memory where journalists have actually given the right advice. And that's the case of Rahul Gandhi. Now, I've been fairly scathing about Rahul Gandhi over the last few years. And I'm not alone in this. So have many journalists. And the advice they've given him has been pretty much uniform. They have said, don't go off on holidays to mysterious locations. Don't sit around acting like everybody will come to you while you play with Pidi and you listen to them and Pidi is busy eating biscuits. Don't act as though you're a genius when it comes to party management because traditionally you make the wrong personal decisions and state units are thrown into a mess because of that. We've said that when you say that you resigned as Congress president, act like you mean it. Don't hang around in Delhi making all the decisions anyway. We've said get a real Congress president, get a guy who can do the organizational stuff, free yourself from doing all that. I don't think that Rahul Gandhi has actually listened to any of us because from what little I know of Rahul Gandhi, he doesn't listen to anybody. But believe it or not, he's doing pretty much what everyone has suggested he should do.